Hello guys, today we are going to check out this fire department ship that I found on the Steam Workshop. That, there's way better things than I could ever create in my life. So, you, so I found this ship and it's supposed to be a fire ship. See, fire capabilities here and here. And I'm pretty sure there's one on the roof and on the front. Why did I just hear a damage noise? This thing already got damaged and I haven't pulled it out of the dock. I'm gonna scream. What's that cock swaying? I don't know. <laughs> Let's see, where's the throttle levers? Turn on the main power. Takes too long to turn that on. Couldn't have made that any slower. No, no, why is the main power turning back off? Come on. There's spotlights, deck lights, light bar. Ooh, I can have... Wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. And there's a horn. There's emergency noises. There's interior lights. And instrument lights. I didn't know that was an instrument. I can't make noise with it or play with it. Hmm. So, let's pull this thing out of the dock, I suppose. First, though, let me check if I did somehow damage it doing nothing. No, I heard the damage noise, but no damage has seemed to be done. Okay, let's start the thing's engines, and we are going to... Turn on that cruise control, and we are going to blast out of this dock. Oops, I left the back door open. I think I should go fix that soon. Oh no, don't hit the back. I don't like how these creations, they've been spawning so close to the edge. I've been having trouble pulling these things out of the dock. Because I'm worried that I'm going to, like, spa smash it into the tire thingies, or on the side, or something. So, for speed-wise, for such a small ship... I don't really think it's that fast for being such a small ship like this. I could see maybe for some of the fire equipment that might be heavy. But we're going to put this up to a few tests. And what tests you might ask. Tsunami tests and Megalodon tests. Ooh, birdies. Are those birdies? Yes, the birdies are having a congregation on the side of the dock. That's strange. Seems like they must have somehow added animals, because I never really remember seeing, like, ducks and things like that. They've never been in the Let's game. Turn on the navig- what's the light bar look like? Did it go- Oh yeah, it goes- No, I wish it did, just had the- Noise. That'd be so cool. But yeah, they don't have that, so... Let's just turn off that light bar because it's pointless because it doesn't go ee -oo, ee -oo. range. What's that mean? Uh, that's probably how far I can shoot my water. What's this do? So it looks like you can turn on a radar thing. Mode. Um. No idea what that stuff just did. If I exploded the ship, whoops. Mm, there's the power thingies. Let's just close that door so no water gets in. Here's some water canning controls. Let's start using those and see how what that's like. Okay. Are they all on right now? Uh, whoopsies, they're on. Turn them off! Turn those off. Um, oh, I had to turn on monitor power. And there's also infrared, I guess, for nighttime. Do I just, like, control these? Um, uh, what have I done? I think I might have broken. St Look at this. I think I have officially broken Stormworks. 
yeah, look at how weird that stream is just shooting out. And yeah, I'm controlling the wrong one. I guess I don't know my lefts from my rights. It's things, these aren't numbered. Um, so that's how the cannons work. Now let's do some durability tests. Let's get to the helm, and then we can do our durability tests. So first, we're going to tsunami it. And then, we're also just going to press the Megalodon button just a few times. Not too many. Not many times at all. Yeah. Not too many times. Totally not spawning in like... 200 megalodons right now totally not doing that yeah totally not spawning in way too many megalodons this ship could never survive oh geez yeah that's way too many megalodons oopsies lucky i didn't do a huge ship yeah because i don't like lag i hate lag trim. I don't know what I just did. I'm just gonna reset that. I, I know a lot of people will say I should have tested this against fire, but I'm not really good at aiming those cannons. It's pretty hard. So, see the, all those megalodons? They're all out there. They're all swimming towards me, going to kill me as the tsunami is coming and that's going to kill me as well so let's see which one will kill me first megalodons versus the tsunami round one ding 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 let's just make the day like it at 12 o'clock exactly pretty much hmm let's see what happens let's put in some fog so then it's harder to see the megalodons and the tsunami so then that gives each an advantage and then we'll put some rain in it too oh my gosh look at the weather conditions i think i might die oh no let's activate the spotlights yay spotlights woo you see the lightning? I'm glad I'm not flying an airplane or that would have been broken. I should have put that water shooter thingy back out, but I didn't. So, back down, I mean. Hopefully that's not an issue. We can activate some in interior lights, instrument lights. What's like down here? Looks like there's some fire suits I think there's some diving equipment down here oh is there an interior I didn't even see oh wow I didn't I guess that's why this ship is so slow then cuz there's like a full is this a bathroom I the my favorite part about stormwork ships is when they include a toilet and stuff like that. That's always great. It's funny. And then they have a bed for me to go to sleep in. I love sleeping. No, I don't. I hate sleeping. Sleeping is like the worst thing ever. I wish I could stay up eternally. Hey, it's an engine room. And it's cautious. So we have to go in here, don't we? Ooh, am I going to get killed in here? Um, why is the engine losing air? Hmm, maybe it's the fog and the humidity. Maybe, I don't know, but the air is fluctuating like crazy. Let's see if it's happening in the other engine. Yep, they're both fluctuating like crazy. So that's pretty weird. I'm pretty sure there's also the batteries are here too, but I can barely see them because, oh, I forgot about the flashlight. See, yeah, there's our batteries. There's these balls. 
scientific balls. And then we're going to close this door. We're going to go back up and see if any megalodons have hit us yet. Have we even rode the tsunami yet? When I come up here, and if and if the tsunami's passed, I'm gonna freak out. It probably didn't, cause I most likely would feel that in like the thing. Hmm. Oh jeez, there's one megalodon, and it's like trailing like after me. I wish I knew which way the tsunami was coming from. Don't think it's hit us yet, cause I would have definitely of. Felt some shaking. Trying to see if maybe I can make out where it is. Hmm. Well, that megalodon, man, it is like chasing me. Like, it's right on my tail. Look at it. You know, I'd love to be able to, like, drop something on, like, it's f like an explosive on its face and just go boom and, like, fly away. That would be so cool. Creators of Stormworks add bombs. I don't need any guns, I just want explosives. So then, like, you can throw a bomb at a ship, or a torpedo, and it'll smash, and you can shoot missiles, and they have, like, GPS coordinates in them, and, like, you can, like, or, like, laser targeting or something. That would be amazing. Let's just go take a look at that megalodon in first person chasing us. Um, there it is. Oh yeah, this is totally fine. Two giant megalodons chasing us. We totally don't have to worry about that. Right? Oh yeah, I'm not actually talking to anybody. So, um, this is scary. I really don't know where that tsunami is. Let's just turn down the fog. It's probably like right on our tail. Like right in front of us. Alright, fog is almost lifted. We're gonna shut down spotlights, because that will waste our battery and give us unwanted lag. Oh jeez, there's the tsunami, and there's the 20,000 megalodons all chasing me. Acceptable. I s swore that I saw that there's a hydrofoil on this ship, and I just can't find it. What's mode even mean? It's gonna turn everything on. Um, I think mode might be what gear our engine's in. Press, 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 press. Um, look at those megalodons. That's a bit concerning. Nah, I'm pretty sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight megalodons chasing after us is absolutely acceptable. I'm pretty sure, and everyone should agree about that. Because, I mean, why wouldn't you? Like, that's just amazing, having that many megalodons chasing after you. Like, it's pretty Are these cool. backup engines? No. Remember there was this one ship that I had that would have backup engines, and, like, you could stick it in the water, and go, like, rah, 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 and make you go faster. That was so cool. <sighs> it was pretty cool, that ship. Yeah, we're gonna take this thing head on into a tsunami. Yeah, there's megalodons. Yeah, if they get a hold of my ship, I'm dead. I'm absolutely dead. Dead, 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 dead. Hopefully they don't get me. Let's go take another look at those megalodons, shall we? Hopefully we don't fall out of the ship. Because we're kind of heading towards the tsunami now. And if we hit the tsunami, I'm probably in the megalodon infested waters. Ooh, this is so scary. Because if I fall off, it's done for. Because, like, I feel like they did some stuff to make you, like, swim slower or something. Because I've been noticing that, like, my character walks slower and swims slower. Because I've played this game way before. Um, I even, like, made this YouTube thing. 
because I actually saw someone else play this game, and I thought it was amazing. So, it is. It really is a good game. I think it's now like 20 bucks because they add, did some adding to it. Like, they added, like, um, Ar the Arctic area. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure they up, like, raised the price, like, $10 of it to, like, 20, up to 20. It used to be, like, $10, I think. That's what I, ha that's what I got it for. I don't know what it, it's priced at now. So, we're almost at the tsunami to do its tsunami test. Oh, yeah, I forgot the high waves test. Well, we can just do that right now. We had 2,000 megalodons chasing us, high waves, and an extra high wave in front of us. So this is crazy. After after we um go over the tsunami, I'm going to let the megalodons just eat this thing alive. So it's not taking these waves too well, I can say that. It's not doing well with the waves. It goes pretty slow, and I'm pretty sure the, yeah, the megalodons are going to get us in these high waves. Yeah, look at them. They're um, ferocious to eat this ship. Like They're like, I'm so hungry. I can't wait to eat some hunks of metal, because that's a totally perfect diet for a shark. Yeah, sharks should totally be eating hunks of metal. That's acceptable, right? I mean, if you were shark, would you like to eat hunks of metal? Maybe you could put that down in the comments. Would you like to eat hunks of metal if you're a shark that of that size? Because, in honestly, megalodons are actually way bigger. In that they know that megalodons are actually bigger than what they are in Stormworks. So you could probably eat this ship whole. Whoa, this thing got a bit of air. Some air. Hopefully this thing doesn't capsize. Because I'm pretty sure that might be able to... Oh my god, there's another Megalodon coming from the... F oh, 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 what's that? Oh my god. Look at that. Look at that. That's amazing. Oh, that was amazing. That was the coolest thing I've ever seen in Stormworks. Oh, oh look at all these... Look at all the sharks. They're just like coming out of the tsunami, just attacking me. I'm gonna be dead probably. <laughs> Look at this. That was like the coolest thing. The shark jumped like right out of the tsunami and then just crashed right in the side of my ship. That was crazy. And look, so my my poor signage. Now it's just dunk department. And my perfect signage fire department of the Isle of Dunk. Yeah, these megalodons are gonna, like, come after me. I think I'm just gonna kill my engine. No. Uh, no, we're gonna... Oh, no. They shut off my main power. Oh, no. They shut off the... Oh, my God. I had to go to the breakers. I had to get to the breakers. Get to the... They broke the breakers! Urgh. They broke... I've never had this situation. Uh, they broke my breakers. Oh my god, they broke my breakers. Is there like a... Okay, I'm gonna see if there's like a backup starting thing in the engine room. Hopefully I don't miss any cool stuff. Yeah, I don't think I will. I think I'll just miss me getting destroyed by megalodons. Yeah, the main power's off. Hopefully there's another... Ah, that was a... Oof. That was a... Uh, was that just water? In, uh, we just got capsized. Yeah, I think we should escape. Yeah, we should get out of here. We should definitely get out of here, like, right now. Yeah, we're... Oh, jeez, it's flooding. Uh-oh. Yep, we're getting... This ship is dead. Um, ooh. Oh, uh, oh. Oh, jeez. Yep, this is destroyed. This is what you call a dead ship. Yeah, I don't think you'd be sending any radio communications, because that's kind of broken. And so is the other antenna. The, both of those antennas are absolutely destroyed, so... Yeah. 
there's a I I just can't get over how that megalodon just like jumped out of the water and just scraped my whole ship up. That was oh look at that one. Oh jeez, oh jeez, that just like went through the entire front of my ship. Oh man. Oh here's another one. Oh right in the back. Right in the back, man. Right in the back, man. Ooh he just blew up the engine. Does the fuel tanks... N oh, jeez. That's, like, inside of the, uh, ship right now. And, yeah, I can't really do anything other than flip these breakers, but that does nothing because the main breaker isn't on. So then I can't really do much. Yeah, I think we should get out of here, like, right now. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Yeah, we have to get out of here, like, right now. There's no life support systems, like no lifeboats or anything. Even though I think they'd be gone if there was. Oh, jeez, look at those megalodons who just came out of the water. Wait. Oh my god, they knocked back on the breakers. Um. Yeah, I don't really care at this point. Even if they did fix the breakers, I don't really care at this point. Um, this ship is down now, I think. Let's just close the door. So then this ship doesn't have a terrible fate. Um. Yeah, so this is what Megalodons have done to my ship. Yeah, they just batting them with their heads. Let's go into photo mode real quick. Uh, how do I resume time? P. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. How do I... I just move the camera faster by pressing shift. Oh, jeez. Look at this. Look at this. I mean, they're just, like, infesting the ship. I mean, my character should be dead. Like, he shouldn't have survived this. Yeah, my guy's probably dead. Like, look at this ship. They've brought it, like, underwater. And they're now, like, smashing it even more. I wish it was a little easier to see. But, yeah. Look at what they're doing to it. Is it flooded inside here? No, it's still dry. It's dry in here. How? How is it so dry in here? Like, it should be, like... Absolutely flooded. Is the engine room? Oh, jeez. Look at the engine room. It's a blazing inferno. Yeah, I don't think if you're in this ship... Yeah, you're not getting... You're not going to be able to drive this ship. I mean, how much do you think that costs? That ship? I don't know. Maybe a couple thousand? I don't really know. Heck, a couple hundred thousand. Oh, I don't really know. I'm no ship expert, but yeah, I'm pretty sure when this happens to your ship, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's absolutely destroyed. And if this video does go on YouTube, this will probably be the thumbnail. <laughs> Just saying. Look at this, I mean, this is insane. Like, come on. Like, just look what they've done to this poor ship. It's absolutely destroyed. Look at those big bullies. They're just smashing the ship up. Look at that bully just eating the ship. Look at these bullies. I mean, look how much they're bullying this poor ship. What did it do to them? Yeah, I guess it's in your habitat, but you don't do that. Why don't you just ask it nicely to get out? That would be a much nicer way, Mr. Megalodons. Don't you think that would be nicer, Mr. Megalodon? Yeah, Megalodons don't talk, so he's probably not going to answer. But anyway, I think that this is, like, I'm pretty sure we're going to wrap this up at this point, because you, pro you probably already know, like, what's happened, like, what's happened to the ship is just insane. And if you want to see this yourself, go ahead and 